precaution at the school and there is a safety in uh, this thing. I think it's okay for them to resume and there is a maybe this uh, one one meter uh, distance. So I didn't see what is bad in it. I think it would be wise and it would be good for school to resume but then we have to adhere strictly to the instructions and the guidelines given. If we can all obey that then it's good to go because already the children are tired of staying at home. It's not a safe time for you know children of different backgrounds to come together to start you know in the name of education. All over the world, this thing is trending, and so I don't think uh, parents should actually encourage that at this time. Well, in terms of safety, I don't think it's safe. But notwithstanding, if they are going to be postponing it, the resumption, then the government should put in place strategies to prevent or mitigate the spread of the virus. And that's the unfortunate thing about it. It's not just about postponing, but there must be in place a strategy to prevent um, the spread of the virus in schools. Yeah, I think it's safe since uh, the use of fixed masks. I think it's safe for them to go back to school instead of them sitting at home now. If the right instrument like the COVID-19, they can follow the right procedure like sanitizing their hand, washing their hand whenever it's necessary, their face masks. I think it's safe because keeping them at home, it's already it's long overdue. Um, I would say there should be a pause in the resumption. It's a bit risky, actually risky, because people are, people are not so certain. They, are, they don't believe that this second wave is real. This second wave is, is viral, is dangerous. It might, test, it might test negative today and test positive tomorrow. Yeah, it depends. If the government can be able to provide the necessary amenities to, in order to keep the students social distance, to provide that social distance in a class in, in, and the environment of the school, if they can keep it clean and make it more conducive for students that there can be a little spacing, a mo much more spacing between them, I would advise that the school should be resumed. But once that thing cannot be done, our advice that they should still keep them at home, most especially those little children, because it is not safe. Okay, um, I'll say they should wait for, they should wait, they shouldn't let school resume yet, because we don't really know how the uh, COVID, all the COVID stuff, we don't know how it's like, like we don't know how big it is here. We, just, we are just hearing it from the news, so we don't really know how big it is. But I would say shouldn't do resume yet until we are certain that everything is okay. Well, um, the second wave is very, um, very hard for everybody, but I think um, government should consider um, some students because people have been staying long. Like, okay, um, recently, as a call of the strike, um, people have stayed for home for a, more than a year now. So, um, if I advise, if I may advise, Government should consider some students, more especially high institutions, they should go back to school, but this, we are going to put some measures on ground. I think safety is, is the first thing, so the best thing, I, I don't think school should resume now. That, that's no no for me, that's my own opinion, so I don't know what else. I think that that's so. all. <laughs>